Hi, welcome, Cat from Sacred Soul Rising. So, I recently um, read something, um, a comment that somebody had written about that they had been researching all the twin flame coaches on how to balance. They needed how to be the expert balancer on balancing the DM in. And the fact that they were in mind over balancing the DM in was alarm bells for me. And I want to explain to you that this journey, remember, this journey, if you make this journey about balancing the DM back in, it is never going to happen. Why? Because this is a journey of unity consciousness. This is a journey of oneness. This is a soul's journey. And balancing them back in sounds like you're just about to take an exam on, I don't know, some gymnastic exam. That is not this journey. This journey is you, is you energetically shifting. While ever you are trying to balance them back in and focusing on them, it is not going to work. This is a journey of you. And whenever I see those 3D questions focusing on union and balancing DM and all about DM, which really is just the polarity, the other polarity. Because remember, yes, we can use D uh, divine feminine, divine masculine, but really it is just the polarity. It is the polarity finding equilibrium. It is the one soul learning how to balance in the 3D. And while ever you are focused on balancing the DM back in, you're, it's not the journey. It's just not the journey. And so be really, really focused on why you're doing this journey. Why are you on this journey? Are you on this journey to balance the DM back in? Or are you on this journey for you? But who is you? You are a soul. And you and your DM connect at soul. You are one at soul. And this is a journey of unity consciousness, of oneness. And while ever you are seeing them as the DM, you are in separation consciousness. And that's the bottom line. And I ask you now, are you seeing them as separate to you? Are they separate to you? Are you trying to figure out what they are doing? Or are you surrendered fully into the journey knowing it is one? And that is it. You don't need to question them. You don't need to ask about them. Because you are in unity consciousness. You don't need to research. Because you know that you are one. And that is what this journey is about. Focus on anything else and you will stay in separation. You will stay in that yearning, wanting, needing, just outside of your reach. And that isn't this journey. And you know, I think I've mentioned it before. I was in this debate the other day about with in in spiritual community and this is probably one of the main reasons why 
you only go to people that are truly on the journey, that understand it from a soul's point of view of unity consciousness and that it is an awakening. And some of these top advisors were having a debate about whether twins even existed. And the fact that they were talking about twin flames as individuals showed that they they didn't understand the journey and that is that is perfect because unless you're on the journey and early on in the journey you will be in separation consciousness you will be because you know you've gone through that bubble of phase and you're thinking it's it's about another person but once you shift on this journey and you really start to understand that this is about you and always has been about you and you coming into unity consciousness and into those higher states and higher frequency, that's when the journey changes. And this really highlighted to me the other day, If I know before I've seen people post and say, I've, I've been on this journey a long time and I went and had a reading and they came back and said that I, it's just a, a soulmate. It's just a soulmate. Well, you cannot approach this journey as, as two individuals. You will know if you're on this journey. You will feel it. And one of the biggest ways to really understand if you're on this journey is doubt is in... Is, such a big one because I can honestly tell you in all the time that I have been reading for people and bearing in mind if anybody reaches out to me and goes can you do a reading for me cat no I don't read on twin flames it is one soul I will coach you I will help you understand the journey from a soul's point of view but I will not do readings on this journey why? Because it's not about another person. It is about you and your frequency and you coming back to you. And once you shift into the frequency, that's when the journey changes. And so one of the things is doubt. Doubt is massive on this journey. Never have I had anybody ever come to me and go, I d I, I've got so much doubt whether I'm in a soulmate connection. Never. But the twin flame, which is really the awakening journey, the doubt is there all the time early on. And then ego death. And suddenly, you know, you are led by synchronicities. You know, it's really interesting today in Awaken to Consciousness, we posted some pictures I ended up posting a picture of how my frequency has changed just by my look and my eyes and just the aura around me. And then everybody else started posting pictures of themselves. And it was really incredible on how just looking how their frequency had changed and how they'd really shifted into sovereignty while they had been on this awakening journey. It is truly incredible how you change at every single level. And that is the point. On this journey, you awaken, your whole light frequency changes. You awaken at every single body. The light body, the emotional body, the physical body. Every single, the energetic body, every single part of you is changing. It is really, truly incredible. And, you know, if you've been on this journey a while, have a look at a photo of yourself. Look at your eyes. Look how you, the energy and the frequency around you has changed. It really is incredible. This journey is so much more than just getting your DM. Please, please shift out of that because once you shift out of that, this journey will then start to change for you. If you need more help and support, my website is there. I offer one-to-one -one coaching, 
to really tell you the truth of the journey. I also have my course which takes you through the whole journey so you know each stage and and what to do, you know, but really it's about being, but so you don't keep on repeating those cycles over and over again. If you need more help and support, my website's there. Click down in the description. You'll see all the details. I send you so much love. Many blessings.